Someone asked me on Instagram how I am beating uh, the, the leaves. So I'm using um, two needles, one with a double thread. This basically I take one long thread, fold it in half and thread it to my needle. And this is what I what I thread my needle and my beads on. And then I have a second needle with just a single thread. This is what I use to couch. So you thread enough beads to cover your line. The long, the more beads you have on your string, um, I would leave just a tiny bit uh, of empty string at the end, just because I like. To, well, I like to couch it between every single bead, and when you do that, it takes space. So at the end, you will eat up that thread that's left. So I'll show you what I mean. Um, you start a tiny bit uh, outside the line, and you end a tiny bit outside the line again. So I'm going to put this in there and take it out again for the next line. Now I'm going to take my other needle. I like to, if you're, if the beaded line is curved, I like to come out from the outside. And then go in the inside. Just to help you curve that line I'm going through a knot here that's why it's hard to push in You don't have to bead through every single, uh, you don't have to couch between every single bead, but if you're doing a curved line, it's better, just so that you can have like a nicer defined line or curve. Um, and see now the extra thread that I had left at the edge is all gone because it was eaten up by this spacing between each bead. And that's how I do it.